learn from the mistakes of others, be patient. You see these cars making their turns. You see that car's going in really fast. And then she came in really hard. She had to run the light, the light just turned green. So if you come in really fast to your turns, case example, um, you're gonna have to crank that wheel like this car with the truck with the motorcycle going in really slow. Don't want that motorcycle to tip over. But I always scan the intersections and because I've been in the traffic industry, I look at intersections and cars and what drivers are doing differently than a lot of people who are just saying, hey, you know, I'm just gonna drive, you know, what is the time of day? It's almost 4.30 Eastern Standard Time. People are tired, they're coming home. These cars are gonna run a lot of lights. This is this is your the virtual classroom. This this is real life out here. You see cars, you see buses, young drivers, and, and from uh, three, uh, three to five, this is the most dangerous time because you have a lot of young, inexperienced drivers that are out here. And if you have young, inexperienced drivers, they're going to make mistakes. They're going to lose control. So you wanna reduce those odds and be able to, um, so if you're feeling anxious or scared, I'm gonna give you some more information. You wanna practice, you've gotta practice in this type of driving so you feel more comfortable. You gotta consider taking additional lessons that is offered. Practice in empty parking lot, but this is a little bit different. This is not an empty parking lot. This is real life driving that I showed you. I'm gonna flip screens a minute. This is, this is real life driving. And if you're not careful and you run a light, you're going to get hit or get killed or be injured. So I teach those positive things so you don't have an accident. So you have a good driving record and it's very important. You wanna have gradual exposure.